today we're going to just talk a little bit about long-term storage of your mycelium cultures. So regardless of what mycelium you wish to preserve, um, it is wise to preserve it in a slant. Uh, but unlike traditional slants, these slants are just distilled water and contain no media. This way of storing slants I've found is very convenient, easy to do, and can store a lot more transfers than a traditional slant. Here you can see I'm just simply taking my scalpel, cutting transfers, and transferring them directly into the sterilized distilled water. I filled the slants to about 8 milliliters, as these are 10 milliliter vials. And as I add these transfers into the vial, it will raise the water level until there is almost no headroom. What you want to do is ensure that there is very little oxygen at the top of the slant, and this will help to prevent anything from going bad. Don't worry about the transfers getting a little bit jammed up together when you're putting them in there. Um, after you're done, just screw the cap on nice and tight and shake it up. I like to bang it on something or flick it in order to really just get the transfers to all suspend evenly so they're not bunched up together and uh, they're all in water, there are no pockets of air. Label up. Uh, I put strain name, I like to uh, label the spore generation and the uh, clone generation and then I will put a date. Well, this has been it. I hope you enjoyed and I wish you luck in your long-term mycelium storage and subscribe to my Patreon to receive more in-depth guides.